guys, welcome back to my channel today. Um, I've got a great video for you today. It is the Feel Unique to Mix. Um, I got it a little bit earlier this month um, and it came really early as well, which was really good. Um, so I just thought I'd film it. I know my, I think it was a couple of videos ago, it might have been a Feel Unique to Mix, but this time I was eager and I got it on the day that um, I could renew again. So if you don't know what it is, it is um, not a monthly subscription, it's a monthly thing that you can do. It's, you pick five samples per month and um, they can range from anything. They have tons of stuff on there, beauty stuff, makeup, skincare, um, sachets, tubes, pots full. There's not full sizes, but it's a great way to try things out. And if you're new and you're from Lightning Last, welcome. Um, I had so much love on that video and I didn't think it was going to do as well as it did, so thank you. And if you're new and you've just stumbled, welcome. Um, so yeah, let's just get straight into it. Obviously I took my address off it. It's a good one this month. I remember what I would literally I ordered it on the 5th and, I, and it came literally two days ago, like less than two days ago. So haven't used it but I did look in it because I knew what I I remembered what I'd ordered this time so it's a corker this month right let's, let's get straight into it so every month when you do it you get five five samples that you choose and then you get your three three five a month and then you get your three ninety five back so you get Santa code that has to be used within 60 days and you can it's basically free postage basically on your next order uh, I've not done it yet um, I've not done it yet because I've not needed to order anything off Feel Unique, um, but I will be soon. Um, so if I don't use this code, I'll put it up on the screen. Um, but I'll just get straight into it. I'll try and hold the box as well as I can because I don't want anything to fall out. So um, when you get it, it looks like that's exactly what I didn't want to happen. This, if you can see. And something's falling out. It wouldn't be me if I didn't drop things. So let's get straight into it. Okay, so this month they had a range of stuff. Um, and normally you can, um, you know, when you sort by, sort by lowest to highest, or sort by newest, sort by popularity. And I thought I'd sort by newest this time. And when I went on there, sorry, I got something in my eye. I've got, I've got a new mascara. My eyelashes are just not playing today, so I feel like I've got something in my eye. Um, so when I went on there, the new stuff that was on the first page, I'd already seen. So I was kind of like, oh, maybe there isn't anything new, but I'll just keep clicking through and I found some good stuff. So it's worth looking properly. Normally I like do it by tube or I do it by, um, I don't really have time for little sachets. So unless it's something I really, really want. It's good for foundation though, so you can get to try. But um, yeah, I just clicked like page two or three and there was new stuff on there. So it's worth having a look. So let's get on with, it's mostly makeup this month, which is not like me. And there's no Burt's Beads, I promised you I wouldn't get it, see? Um, let's start off with um, this one. So um, I was looking on there and I saw that there was the Benefit Goof Proof Brow Pencil. Let's just hold that for you. I'm trying to film a bit better today. Hopefully there's not much glare. So I was expecting this to come in a little like card, because it said it was a card. Because you can choose between card, pot, tube, sachet, and other. And usually other means it's like a little like, comes in a card format. And I'm so happy I got this because I love the benefit stuff and I'm on the market for a new brow pencil. I have been testing the IT Cosmetics Universal Brown. Um, it does come up quite like a dark colour on me. I haven't got it on today. So if I want to have a cool brow, it's really good. I wouldn't say it's warm at all. So I thought I'd try it and this is what it looks like. So that's the thing and it's a tiny tiny little eyebrow pencil so you know when you like have you got you've got like a favorite eyebrow pencil or eyeliner and you sharpen it down to nothing i used to be that teenager oh my goodness okay i might have got the wrong shade um because it's quite difficult it's hit and miss on there 
Um, same with foundations, you know, it's hit and miss, which is good in a way because you could like want, you could get a selection of like four foundations if you wanted the same foundation, and then you could narrow down what sort of like shade you are before you go and spend forty pounds on a foundation. So this is so cute. It's so tiny. I don't even know if you can even see that. It's that cute. It's so tiny, and it's, there's not much in it. Literally, there's enough for maybe for like two uses. But it's so cute, I'm just gonna swatch it. I don't wanna waste it. Oh, come on. It's quite dry, I don't know if it's because it's a sample. I have used their break on it before. Okay, so that's quite a nice warm brown. I actually got a blonde, blondy taupe colour. Because now I've got pink hair, which is now faded out to like a corally candy floss colour. Um, I can actually go um, quite ashy with my brows or really warm. So, oh look, it probably won't done if you can see that swatch or not. I'll leave it on there anyway to take pictures of it. So that's super cute. Really good actually, if I was gonna go away for the night. Um, and it's really good to try. So I'm just gonna double check on filming. I do hate doing this, but my camera just flashed at me. We're still good, we're good, we're good. Normally I charge my battery every time I film, but I haven't this time. So, that's super cute. Well worth it finding that sound, but I'll probably get like maybe two uses out of it. I'm quite heavy handed with brow products. Um, I have had my eyebrows microbladed, but I'm having a darker pigment put in, so I am filling them in. Um, I am going to talk about them when I do my microbladed journey. I'm keeping pictures and videos, um, so if you're not interested, but um, it's not what you don't go in and you don't. And I've seen other people who have microblading as well and come out with this perfect brow. It does take time. Um, I still have to fill my brows in, which was to me the whole point of not getting it done. So I think my expectations were here, and I'm not saying the Michael Blade is very good because she's amazing. So let's crack on. Um, I've got. We'll go with this. So I've been using the Clinique um, All About the Eyes. I got a little sample of it, a little pot, like a five mil pot, and I love it. But the only thing is, it is really moisturised my under eyes. The only thing is I feel like it's bringing out my dark circles. Um, it's great to use in the morning and great to use at night time and it's very nice. But I feel like it's bringing out my dark circles. Like I had, my house, I had some photos done the other day and I noticed and I was just like, ooh, okay. So I saw this and it was the last thing I put in my basket to be honest. Um, and I thought I'd try it. So it's the Mattis Beauty Expert Reviving Eye Cream. Puffiness, dark circles, eye care. So it's basically for dark circles and puffiness. Um, it's French, so that's good. And it's just a little um, three mil sample. Preview. It's nothing um, crazy, but it's a good way to try it out and see. Because I don't know whether I'm just really tired, like because I've, been, I've had this nasty cold and I'm, my dark circles are showing more, or whether it is the clinique, because sometimes the ingredients can be different on everyone's skin. So this is a brilliant way to try it. I'll just try a tiny bit on my hand. Oh, it's quite, it's not sealed. Oh, okay. So it's just, you wouldn't even be able to see that. It's clear. Doesn't smell, doesn't smell of anything. Like, I've just stick my finger on this. Doesn't smell of anything. It's clear, it's very soft, very cooling actually. Really nice in the summer. Sunk in my skin straight away. Really good, really cute. And let's go for the thing that I saw. I saw this on the the first, because obviously my date I can use is the fourth, fifth, because it renews on the fourth, but I can use it on the fifth. And I went on there just to see if there was anything really good that I really wanted, and I was like, I just have a quick look. Because I forgot where my date was. And this is what made me I was so excited to get this. It's, I was like, I have to have this, uh, because, well, I have to. So, <laughs> um, it is a Givenchy, I think that's how you say it, Givenchy Gloss Brilliant Extreme Colour High Shine Lip Colour Enhancer. And if you, ever get, if you have a Givenchy, I think it's Givenchy, a counter, at your local house of fairies or Devonhams, Go and try and get a sample of them. I had a sample of a um, mascara. 
five. What's this? What size is this? I don't know, I think it's a 5ml or 3ml and it was actually amazing. The packaging was beautiful. I'll try and take a picture of it and put it on the screen, but it was beautiful and it was a sample. Their samples are really generous. They're not like, oh, I'll just put it in the pot. They're generous. So, this is how it looks. Now, I know what you're thinking before you see it. It's 16 Noir. Now, it looks black and it's glittery. It's a lip gloss, okay? <laughs> so, that's what, ooh, there we go, butt fingers. Gotta love my videos, don't you? Right, so, it's a 3.5 ml. So nice, okay, so I tried this on my hand the other day, and I went thinking, oh my God, it's black, but when it comes out, it's actually like a, a purple, it's really nice. I hope these are working, obviously. I'll do a swatch for you. And it goes on really weird if you've ever seen um oh, what's it called i think it's lipstick lipstick queen do a, a blush i think yeah lipstick queen do a blush that comes out black but it's got like a so that's what it looks like it'd be quite nice to put on top of the dark lip i think or on its own if i wipe it off i rub it in should we say it leaves like a, a gorgeous pink stain it's it, it's crazy, it's black in there, it's purple when you put it on, but when you rub it, it's like, it's like a gorgeous, magenta -y, dark, magenta -y stain. So it'd be really nice for like, on a night out, or in the summer, or it does, it smells fruity, it's not like a sticky gloss, it smells so good. So yeah, it's like a lot of glitter in it. It's it's something you could pair with the smoky eye and it looked really, really nice. So that's what I was like, yep, bam, going straight in my basket straight away. Givenchy, love, really, really love that. And that's the thing that made me want to get this. I was just like, yeah, I'm gonna get it. Sometimes I get it, sometimes I don't. Most of the time I get it, to be honest, because it's cheaper than getting a subscription box, so. Yeah, I am getting March's Birch Box now because there is the Bad Girl Benefits new mascara in it. So I am getting that. <laughs> and the next thing is, um, this was something that I wanted to try for a long time actually. Um, I'm really into like, I'll just show you it quickly. It's the This Works Sleep Deep Sleep Pillow Spray. It's just a 2.5 ml. And I'm really into like, I'm a weird hippie like that. I'm really into essential oils and um, diffusers and candles and um, all that sort of stuff. And when I was younger, I hated the smell of lavender. I could not stand it. But I find it's helping with my migraines. It's helping me sleep better. Um, I still have a bit of a cold. But I'm, I'm finding that it's it's really nice now. It's not, I'm, I'm liking the smell of it. So I thought I'd try the little pillow space. It's, space spray <laughs> can't get to sleep try our best deep sleep pillow spray contains a powerful blend of true lavender chamomile and revert to help you sleep fall asleep faster and naturally wake up feeling more refreshed shake well samples so you can put this um you can which is really good, I like this the saying isn't it? Resonate a healthy sleep pattern and restore your get up and glow with a better night to sleep. I feel like your skincare and your sleep and what you eat is better than makeup in my eye personally. You can you can tell if someone's not slept. If I've not slept or I'm ill, I look dead. So let's give this a go. So there's a tiny little bottle from this works. I mean this works is holy. Um so cute. Right, I'm gonna spray it. I don't know if I can smell it because I've got a cold. Right, I spray it on the sleeve. No, yeah. You can spray it on your pillow, so. Oh, I missed. Oh, that smells so good. What does that smell like? It smells like um, a really nice, like bath soak. A really gorgeous. Basic. I know this is a full range. I know that they do. Um, oh, that's a little left. That Givenchy is left a bit of a stain on my own. Um, I know that they do um, a, a bath oil, a body lotion, 
something else, I'm sure they do. I actually have some roller balls coming that I can put on my pressure points, my wrists, on my forehead and here, um, which are I will show you when I get them. They're not from this works, but they're kind of the same sort of ethos. But I wear that for poo. You know, I just sleep in all day, but it's really nice. It's not strongly lavender, so don't be afraid. Um, it smells of lavender and chamomile, so there's a bright amount of balance. So don't be afraid if you like, oh, I don't like lavender. It's really nice, really nice. So I'm so glad I got that. And the last item, and I'm so, this is so cute, it's beyond a joke. So with, as I said before, with the hit, it's a bit hit and miss. I love filming a neat for mix, as you can tell. But sometimes you get something in it, like for example, a Givenchy, no, a Gershlin bronzer, which I love to death. I still have it, I am smearing it as much as I can, I'm getting as much as I can possibly out of it. But it's on a card, so it's a piece of paper, so it's a piece of card with powder on it. Which said it was an other, so it said it was a pot. So it's just like, it's a bit hit and miss, and I didn't have high hopes for this next product. I honestly thought it was going to be a bit of powder on a card, and it's going to be like one use. But it's not, and it is so cute, so I'm just going to show you. So it's the Mary Lou... Mary Lou um, highlighter, Mary Lu Mary Luminizer, Manionizer it says, but it's Mary Luminizer by the Balm. Everyone's heard of this, the Mary Luminizer. It's an incredible highlighter. So I can't show you today because I have highlighter on. But it's by the Balm. And I'm so glad I got this, like literally, it's a size of so small my eyeshadow. Mine's come a little bit damaged, but I'm not too bothered about that because it's not cracked or anything. Oh my god, I'm gonna swatch it. Let me see if I can. I don't want to heavily use it because I really would like to use it on my face. <laughs> it's like a gorgeous champagne colour. I don't even know if you can really see that. It pops on my nose. Might look ridiculous, so yeah. Preview. <laughs> I've probably got white nose now, <laughs> but yeah. Oh, it's beautiful and it blends out so gorgeously and it's killer. And I'm gonna keep this for summer. It's not too um too in your face. That's I thought it was, I was very scared of it because when I've seen people using it, use a fan brush, and I just like, pack it on. It's like pow, pow, it's a highlighter. I was a bit scared of it, but actually if you use a little bit, little bit and like blend it out, it's quite subtle. It'll give you a really nice healthy glow. So, and, and that is a little, does it say what size it is? 57, 0.57 grams. So cute. So cute. So cute. So this month's box, I am, well, pick a mix selection. I'm really, really thrilled. So I got a spray, a pillow spray, a Mary Luminizer, a pretty much, to me, very generous sample of Givenchy, a brow product, an eye cream. There's my five samples, and I'm very happy, and I'm glad that I actually scrolled through more than the second page on the new stuff this time, because when I've seen it, I've kind of been like, how do people get like a mini sample? Like there's a, oh, what's the perfume called? I'll pop it on the screen. But it's like a, it looks like a little Windex, like a little window spray. Um, how did they get that? And it was like tiny. And I, how did you get that? It's because I wasn't looking properly. So yeah, I'm very happy with this month's box. Um, it's I'm I'm very happy. So that's this month's pick and mix box. Um, any suggestions, any videos you'd like to see, um, let me know down below. There will be a blog post to follow this. Do check out my blog and my social media and stuff. And if you follow me, I'll follow you back. I'm not in it for followers, really, I'm not. Um, and yeah, thanks very much for watching and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.